What's going on guys, welcome to another Cichlid Skate video. In this video we're going to look at the newly planted 10 gallon but make sure you subscribe and check out the channel for next week as the video is going to be a really cool one on how to sell the fish that you've bred to the local fish stores in your area. Going from obviously breeding the fish to growing them out and then eventually moving the fish so they can be sold to the store. I recently took these blue neon juveniles in on Thursday and they're doing absolutely cracking so far. So be sure to subscribe so you don't miss that one. But now let's look at the 10 gallon. So overall the tank's doing absolutely brilliant and for my first planted tank I'm unbelievably happy with it. The Italian Val in the back is sending out runners, the Dwarf Sag is growing pretty nicely and hopefully that will propagate soon. The Java Moss is spreading all over the rocks just like I intended it to do. The Anubius Nana Petite is growing, losing some leaves but oh, oh yeah um, and we, we got a discus. Before you start commenting, a 10 gallon is too small for a discus, don't do it, it's bad for the fish, yeah I know, as you can see it's just a young one and my friend over at Pittsburgh Pets were struggling with this guy just in terms of it eating because it was a bigger discus in the tank so he gave me him just for a little bit so I could put some size on him just in this 10 gallon tank because he knows there's not many other fish in there so he's going to get well fed, I'm doing 50% water changes twice or three times a week so he's doing really good. So don't worry about that before you start commenting. I know it will come in. So the plan with this guy is just to basically look after him, feed him plenty of food, do plenty of water changes on him, and then once he's grown, give him back to Pittsburgh Pets, and then continue to stock the tank how I originally intended. Until then, I'm just gonna enjoy the discus and enjoy watching him grow, which he's definitely doing. I'm only feeding him flake. Uh, it's a special beef art flake and he's absolutely crushing it. Um, everyone says discus are really really tough to keep and I've not had any issues, I've had him about 3 weeks now, I've put him through probably about 12, 13, 14 water changes, no issues, he's doing absolutely great and he's eating really good too. So it's really making me wonder about doing discus in the future and potentially in the 55 once I finish growing out my remaining blue neon fray. On another note, the other fish in there is the little German Blue Ron and I absolutely love him, he's awesome. Him and the discus get along quite well and for the most part he's just searching around looking for food all day, which is really cool to watch. Anyway guys that's all I've got for you today, hope you've enjoyed this video, I'm absolutely buzzing with how this planter tank's looking and hopefully it carries on growing the way it is now and then we can get it looking more and more like a jungle each time I show you it, which I'm hoping to be every week or two. If you've got any suggestions on plants or anything like that, leave them in the comment section below. And we'll see you on the next video that will be about taking that stud muffins fry to the LFS.